Once in a while, a motion picture comes along that is unlike any you've ever seen. Splatter University. <laughs> yes, at Splatter U, the school color is blood red, and the most important lesson is survival. <gasps> Enroll at Splatter University and earn a higher degree in terror. Splatter you. <laughs> Hello everyone, what's up? It's me again, Junkmaster 3 and finally I'm back with another review video because it was a while since I did a review video and I decided why not do another review video of a movie which I've seen. Now, the movie we're going to talk about today is a movie called Splatter University, and like you can see in front of you, or in front of me on the table, is that I have both the DVD uh, edition of the movie and the VHS edition. I don't know exactly if they're like the exact same edition of the movie, like if it's the same uncut version or whatever, but yeah, uh, I am going to talk about the movie, and the movie is from 1984, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, 1984. And um, it's directed by a guy called, uh, now let's see here, uh, no it doesn't say anywhere, um, damn, I knew that before, but he hasn't directed that many movies, so I'm probably going to put a link or something down below in the description if you want to know more about the director or the more information about the movie, but yeah, the movie is basically about this uh, teacher who comes to this new um, university. And uh, yeah, it's not called Splatter University, like you can probably understand by now, but uh, the movie is called Splatter University because there are a bunch of murders happening there, and um, she, uh, the teacher, get to know the thing that there's been a killer uh, in there, and she knows that the previous teacher actually got murdered uh, the, uh, the previous semester. So... Uh, or the previous season, or whatever you want to call it, but and she sort of doesn't really want a job anymore because she just doesn't want to job there or take a job there. So yeah, um, but she eventually decides to take the job anyway because the the head principal wants wants her to take the job anyway, and he says it's gonna be fine. It's nothing, nothing's gonna happen. But eventually things start happening by yeah people getting killed once again. Uh, the students and so on. Uh, so it's your typical slasher if you say so. Now the uh, things that I didn't like about this movie is the fact that the kills seems to be very... Uh, they are very boring in a way. It's not like you, you're really, really rooting for the next kill. It's more like, oh my god, I've seen this again and again and again. It's like the same sort of kill over and over again. Uh, which makes this movie feel a little bit boring and Overall, I think it is quite boring in some parts where it doesn't really happen anything. And uh, even though it just runs for, now let's see, it runs for about 78 minutes, so it's not long at all. And even though it just runs for 78 minutes, it feels like it runs for 1 hour and 40 minutes. And that's never a good sign. But something I really did enjoy about the movie is a, a, a little twist towards the end which I didn't see coming, and uh, yeah, I don't want to spoil it if you want to see this movie, so yeah. And uh, some of the blood and gore effects, they were okay, I mean, it's not really that much in, in the amount of gore, it's more, of the, it's more blood effects than gore, I don't really remember if there was any big gore scenes in this, but um, everything else is quite good, I mean, the camera work and the sound and everything, uh, the picture quality may might not be the best. I'm not sure if they've released this on Blu-ray or not, but um, I don't care. I, the picture quality has never like bothered me. Um, but yeah, and uh, I think if you're a die-hard slasher fan, check it out. But like I said, I me myself, I wasn't the biggest fan of it, so I'm ready to give this movie a four out of ten stars on the movie database. Uh, so if you're not a die-hard horror fan. Uh, or die-hard like slasher fan, stay away from this movie. It's uh, it's not worth your time if you're not into that type of uh, horror genre. So uh, yeah, Splatter University. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and you hope you enjoyed and didn't get bored. And I hope to see you again as soon as possible. So see you next time. 
Bye-bye.